Hello! In this video, I am going to talk about the plastic bags that the Walmart is, is doing away with and it is forcing the customer to use the reusable bags. And I, I might comment on that. So I will see you over there on the next page. Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. How is everybody doing? Uh, well, uh, yesterday, as I was reading an article on Microsoft Edge, um, Walmart is doing away with these light plastic bags and paper bags. And having the customers bring in their own reusable shopping bag. And uh, I read the comments on your new that video. And, um, I made a remark too. I made a comment. And this is my comment on it. Wegmans, one of the national award grocery store that was in Forbes magazine a few times. I don't know if they're going to get an award today or not or whenever. Got away with the, the plastic bags, not completely because they're still using them, because people are not buying the reusable ones. And they were 99 cents per bag. I think they're more now. I think they're a dollar now. I haven't been into that grocery store in three years, I think. Because of my disability, I could not shop there inside the store. I, excuse me. So, I don't know what they're doing. I mean, they're trying to, to uh, keep the, the plastic bags out of the dumping, out of the of the trash that get taken to a uh, landfill. And the plastic is an oil-based product that doesn't depose very well. It, it, it doesn't dissolve or disappear. And uh, so you're working their way into trying to avoid the landfill with these plastic bags. Now, what about the reusable ones? We reuse them and then they get old, they get dirty, they, you know, the bacteria is going into those bags. They're not being cleaned. People just reuse them, they bring them in the stores. Yeah, we bring our reusable ones back into the stores. And and we we use them. I I think I'm going to stop this and I'm going to bring over uh a bag. I don't know where it is right now, but I'd like to show you the Wegman bag the reusable ones, and I've been using them for quite a while. Now, that, you know, people, here about the other plastic bags that they're doing away with, the shopping bags. They are using them for carrying other things besides groceries. 
like they keep them and they use them for the kitty litter poop. They put your kitty litter poop in the bag and then take it to the landfill. They use them for other purposes besides groceries. Now, what gets me is what about the, what about those plastic um I know there's some plastics that are being recycled. But a lot of plastic is not being recycled. People are not taking the the pop bottles or the juice bottles that is bottled in plastic that is marked on the bottom as recyclable. A lot of them are not bringing them back to the stores where they purchase these bottles from. Now, that what happens is what they trash get put into the landfills. And these plastics won't redepose just like the plastic bags, the shopping bags that we used to use before these reusable ones come into play. Now, are these reusable ones going to dispose? Because they get worn out and dirty. They're going to get thrown away. Now, is that is going to be a problem? When you throw those bags away? I don't know what you're thinking. A lot of plastic all the plastic, no matter which form or shape or whatever, is made out of oil that we get from the ground. They're all, I have a plastic, here we go, a plastic uh, uh, comb, and that's made out of oil. All the plastics are made out of oil. No matter what shape, um, um, tote bags, no, I mean tote boxes, um, what else? Um, ice cube trays are made out of plastic. Everything is made out of plastic, which is, is the oil base. If the oil is used to make these products. And here they are going through those plastic bags. They don't get deposed, but they can be recycled to make more plastic bags. But not everyone is uh, following the idea. They just trash them in the trash along with the cans and stuff like that. Now what about the cans? Are they disposing too? I mean, here they are trying to to save and try to keep the, the landfill. I mean, these, these plastic bags. Let me tell you about the soap. Soap, like the you know, soap detergent for your clothes, the the softener, liquid softener. Those bottles, they don't get depots. They're on the same line as the plastic bags that we use in the store that we come out with. Oh, they are. I don't know. What's going on here? I think they're defeating their purpose. Because they use plastic bags. Now here's another thing. We use plastic bags to put our trash in. And it's about the same thing as the plastic bags that we carry out from the grocery store or the retail stores using the plain, same plastic. And here they are. Dispose of them. So we are forced to, to buy 
the plastic bags that are meant for trash or for other things. Now, they are just as bad as the, as the grocery bags going out of the store. Well, I mean, what's going on? They might as well go back to boxes. They might as well save the boxes for the for the groceries. Now, I remember when I was a little girl, we, we shopped at the AMP. It was Atlantic Pacific Grocery Store. And we had boxes. Our groceries were, were put in boxes that, that came that the, the product came in to be, be stored on the shelves in the grocery store. We used boxes. And then later, in the later years, the paper bags came in. The paper bags, we used the paper bags. And really, they're defeating the, the purpose of it. Why, why do away with these plastic bags from the retail stores and the grocery stores with the reusable ones when there are trash bags that we buy for every size basket and the trash bags for the leaves outside and I mean that's defeating the purpose of doing it in the stores. If you agree with me, comment below my video here. I want to thank you for watching. And continue to watch Wood Education Blog 43 feature on my channel. You go to my channel, you click on my name next to my picture, you get my channel, and, and scroll down, you would see Wood Education Blog 43. I am planning on uploading more videos on that feature channel. Okay, I want to thank you all for watching them on my feature uh, channel, Wood Education Blog 43. There's 30 of them there. There's going to be more uploaded there. So, I thank you so much and I'll see you here. Don't forget to subscribe and like and share this this video here and more like this one will be uploaded and i want to thank you all for watching all the way through bye do you see the plastic bag in the basket does that defeat the purpose of getting rid of the shopping walmart plastic bag I think so. Okay.